This video demonstrates how to use EasyMTD VAT to submit a VAT return to HMRC when the associated box figures are stored in a spreadsheet. It is assumed the following has already been performed. Signed up for making tax digital for VAT. Signed up for a Fly software account. Downloaded, installed, and launched EasyMTD VAT. The following must be performed when submitting a VAT return for the first time. 1. Add your business. 2. Grant authority. 3. Retrieve VAT information. 4. Specify your account. 5. Submit VAT return. OK, let's get started. 1. Add your business. Click the Add button. Specify the VAT registration number of your business. Specify your business name or click the lookup button. Click the save button. The business name is now displayed in the business list box. 2. Grant authority for EasyMTD VAT to interact with HMRC. Click the authority button. On the HMRC page in your browser, click the continue button. Specify the government gateway user ID and password of the business you added, then click the sign in button. You will now be prompted to receive and specify an access code, which is not shown in this video. Click the grant authority button. Click the copy button to copy the authorization code. Click the paste code button, then the grant authority button. Click the OK button. 3. Retrieve VAT information. Click the Get button. Four. Specify your account. Click the Settings menu, then the Account option. Specify your Fly Software account email and password. Then click the OK button. 5. Submit VAT return. Click the required open obligation, then click the submit button. Click the find button. Locate and click the spreadsheet, then click the open button. Determine where each box figure appears in the spreadsheet. For each box figure, select the sheet name where the associated value appears in the spreadsheet. For each box figure, specify the cell where the associated value appears in the spreadsheet. Ensure the box figures are correct, then click the submit button. Read the declaration text. Tick the declaration checkbox and finally click the submit button. The VAT return is now submitted to HMRC.